Here we go. What up? It's your boy, your boy. Carver Moses. Uh, it's that time again. 2019 Bowman Baseball Jumbo number 11. Let's go ahead and do that. Man, if the Blazers come back and win this game, oh boy. Ah, good old Jumbo. Three autos per box. And of course, before I continue any further, good luck, everybody. Thank you, Abraham. All right. Ain't that some shit, Mike? That's some, you know, that, that's my people right there, Hispanics. Shake my head, man. Shaking my head. Setting us back a hundred years. Blazers looking to come back. Oh, Dame Dalla with the three all in his grill. Yo, if y'all not what if y'all like basketball, my boy Damian Lillard is at 45 points right now. Got a hell of a game right now on TNT. Dude, Lillard's my favorite basketball player in the league, man. He is underrated as fuck. I would take Dame Lillard over any point guard in the league, including Curry, Kyrie, Russell, any of them. Dame is a beast. Got a really good game here, down by uh, it's a seven-point game with about four minutes to go in the fourth quarter. All righty. First box of Mojo. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. Now, oh, that's right. The layout for Jumbo is slightly different than the hobby. MJ Melendez, four ninety nine Royals. I want a Rip City jersey, that's all, for me and Jason. Well, there's our first autograph to 499. Ryan McKenna, Orioles autograph. Damn, that thing was in and out, man. Dame Lillard. Dame Lillard going to have a 50-piece by the end of this for show. Ooh, that's nice. Say Uli Matthias to 99 for the Royals. That's some nice cheese right there. The Bowman Sterling autograph variation. Very nice. 
There you go, Royals. Come on, Blazers, knock out the thunder. I'm tired of seeing Russell Westbrook in the playoffs, man. Ryan Costello, Twins autograph, and Dame Lillard putting the team on his back right now. Man, if Nurkic were on the floor, this would have been done data. Nurkic is a beast. McCollum with a big basket. Down by six. Man, that game's coming down to the wire. Ryan Helsley to 150 Cardinals. Bro, Russell, Russell Westbrook has like zero awareness. That's the smartest thing I've seen Russell Westbrook do all day. Reset the offense. What did they call there? Was that a was that a turnover? <laughs> oh no, it was a foul. Okay. Plenty of basketball to play, man. Two minutes left. Especially with the three ball. Wolf, are you watching the game? It's going to come down to the last possession. I would not be surprised if this game goes to overtime. Wow. Paul George really just missed both those free throws. Man, why y'all don't gotta shoot threes right now? Why y'all shooting threes like that? Get buckets. Acuna Jr. 499 Braves. Austin Riley 125 Braves. Wow, the referees are definitely trying to help the uh the Blazers here. It seems like all the calls lately are going against the Thunder. That's that hometown call player. All right. One box down. Dude, you know, I, I yo, I got so much love for for Westbrook, but as a basketball fan, dude, like he just like He's dumb. Like, he makes stupid decisions on the court. You know, the, his problem is he just he goes too hard. If Russell Westbrook learned how to, like, slow it down... If you learn how to play, I call it with gears. It's like, like for example, in a car. This man is just from first gear to six. You know what I'm saying? Like, just straight balls to the wall. If he knew how to change gears, he'd probably be the best basketball player in the world.
Uh, did the Sixers win? Sixers would play the Raptors. Or the winner of the Raptors series, which is going to be the Raptors. So we got some really good semifinals over in the East. Bucks, Celtics, Raptors, and uh, Sixers. It's a two-point game with a minute 22. Both teams in the bonus. Blazers got two timeouts. Thunder got one timeout. That equals an eternity in basketball. That's roughly four or five possessions. If you use the shot clock. I bet you Russell Westbrook is going to shoot with like 18 seconds left on the shot clock. Watch. Second box. All right, let's see what's in the second box. Good luck, everybody. Especially my peeps without hits. Got another Ryan Costello autograph. Except this one is the four ninety nine for the twenty twin twins. There you go, Ryan. Wow. 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 Yo. If the Thunder lose this game, holy shit. Wait, what is this? Oh snap, nice. A one on one printing plate, and it's a tie game. Printing plate for Nick Nader or the Marlins. One of one mojo. Russell Westbrook passed the, passed the ball, dude. Sheesh. Thunder up by two. Man, this game is going to come down to the wire, boy. Especially if the Blazers hit a three coming off this timeout. Man. It's a really good game. I want to watch it. Mackenzie Gore, 499 Padres. Dude, we got a ways to go still. Still got six more boxes. And the one I'm working on right now. That's the second McKenna autograph for the Orioles. <laughs> Later, CBJ. Have a good night, my dude. Oh my goodness, Damian Lillard is. Did you? Did, did who's watching this game? If you're watching the Thunder Blazer game, did y'all just see that last layup by Dame Lillard? Holy crap! Look at Russell Westbrook putting up a dumbass shot. No awareness, bro. None. Dame Lillard time is Dame time. Why would you shoot it from way? Oh! 
Oh my god! Yo! This dude is the GOAT! Dame time! Oh my god, I called it! I fucking called it! Yo, he shot that shit from like half court! Oh my god! Dude, if you're not paying attention to the Blazers, you definitely are now. Holy, dude, this team might make it to the conference final. This team might make it to the conference final. The way this kid is playing, he is the best basketball player in the NBA right now. Holy shit. Bro, he shot that shit from the logo. Dame time. And he waves goodbye. Oh, what a stud. Dude. Yo, I, I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait to see the press conference after this game. Holy shit. Yep, that cements the 50-point game on Paul George, too. Oh, man, what a stud. Waves him goodbye and everything. What a baller, dude. What a fucking baller. And shout outs to the chick with that mean ass fucking leather jacket. Holy shit. Oh, tiny to 250 for the Angels. Dude, what a game. What a choke by the Thunder. Wow. They had a 12 point lead with like five minutes to go. Welker to 125 Rockies. This is why I love basketball, bro. You could be losing the entire game. All it takes is five minutes of impeccable basketball. And you got the dub. God, I love basketball so much. Dude, no luck. That was not luck at all. He's he's done that before. They, they, sh they just uh, shown a flashback. Dame Lillard got curry range. Blazers, oh my god. They could ride this momentum all the way to the conference finals. That game winner was cold-blooded. Holy crap. Sick hit right here for the Cardinals. Nolan Gorman, 10 of 50. The top 100 variation. Very nice. Dame time, UNC. Dame time. Thank you for getting into the break, Steve. I apologize. I'm 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 riding high right now. Like I'm not even a Blazer fan. I'm a fan of Dame Lillard. I've been a fan of his since he's came into the league. My favorite player in the NBA, so I'm kind of having a moment to myself right now. Kid's a beast, man. I love to see him ball out. Especially in the playoffs, man. People going to pay attention now. Dude put up a 50 piece in a closeout game. Holy shit. Dude, from the Moda Center logo. Are you kidding me? Dude, exactly, UNC. Exactly, man. Dude gets disrespected on the All-Stars year in, year out. He's an All-NBA first team talent. But because he plays on the West Coast... Point guard heavy. You know, they got Russell Westbrook, Steph, you know, they got Curry, Chris Paul. Lots and lots of point, like, like a lot of good point guards in the West. So sometimes Dame Lillard gets overlooked, but the playoffs, man, playoffs is what makes superstars. Nice, Ryan. Dude, you, you got you a good one if she knows what a super fractor is, man. You taught her well, bro. You taught her well. Don't tell her I said that.
nobody's left the arena. I don't blame him. I wonder if Nurkic can come back in time to play this year. The one Thunder fan. Oh, man, that's going to be a meme. <laughs> the lone Thunder fan still there. That's, man, that's got to suck. You saw that, Greg? But, dude, look, look at Paul George playing defense here. Get up on him. He had all the space in the world to get that shot up. I can't wait to see what the M uh, inside the NBA boys are going to talk about, man. Yo, I need me a Dame Lillard jersey like yesterday. is box three all right let's settle down now let's settle down uncle jesse let's get hype with a big hit baby man you got i got i i, I kind of feel bad for russell westbrook you would think a dude that averages a triple double three years in a row would advance deeper in the playoffs. Ever since KD left, he hasn't been able to get out of the first round. Nice little stat for you. Peter Alonso, the 125 Nets. I don't feel bad for Westbrook. You're right, I don't. But, I mean, I, 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 I kind of do feel, I feel for the guy. I don't feel bad for him, but I, I kind of do feel for him. You know, hopefully he learns from this and and stops trying to he like he's just like a fucking. I love him because he balls so hard. You know, he gives you one hundred and ten percent every single game, and I love that about him. But he just his basketball IQ is not up there with the elites. And why are you getting 10 rebounds a game as a point guard, bro? Like, come on. Like, you're that, that's affecting the offense. But anyways. Tommy Romero to 299 Rays autograph. I think they need to define roles out there in, in OKC, man. Let Russell Westbrook do what he do for three quarters. In the fourth quarter, Paul George needs the ball in his hands. Especially in clutch time. Like, that's what they need to do. Paul George needs to be the closer. Let Russell Westbrook do his thing for three quarters. And that's it. Should have came to Miami, Paul George. Should have came to Miami. Reggie Lawson, Padres on a graph. Dude, this Blazers team is dangerous. I would not sleep on this team right now. Dame Lillard and McCullum are playing at an extremely high level. Dame Lillard, I'm telling you, probably the best player in the playoffs right now. Aside from maybe KD, yeah, even my boy D-Wade is like, damn, damn. <laughs> Jake K, 499 Twins. Hey, Joey Wentz, 250 Braves. Ernie, Shaq, uh, Kenny, and Charles are 
talking about the game right now. Man, Russell Westbrook, dog. Talking all that shit, and you can't back it up. Shaking my head. How do you lose a 12-point lead with five minutes to go, dog? Like, seriously. He took some terrible shots at the end of the game. I mean, it's, it's hard to pin a loss on one player in a team sport. But, man, I put that on Russell Westbrook. They lost that game because of Westbrook. Brendan McKay to 150 raise. But then again, they wouldn't have been in that spot if it wasn't for Westbrook. So, kind of a double-edged sword kind of deal there. I hope he figures it out. Maybe they need a coaching change. Maybe Billy Donovan is not the guy. I don't know. They got to figure something out out there because they got way too much talent in OKC. There's an autograph for the Rockies, Vince Fernandez to four ninety nine. They're a lot more explosive, Wolfie. But you got to remember, man. Back then, you know, there was it was a different style. You know, they they had Rasheed Wallace and they had uh, I think they had Damon Stoudemire at the time. Like that team was. Uh, Honestly, that Blazers team could probably play in today's NBA. You know, they, they were run and gun, space and, uh, space and pace kind of team, if I remember correctly. And they probably should have beat the Lakers in that conference final. But, uh, you know, shit happens. Oh man, that team was that was a fun team to watch, Bearded Steve. That was a real fun team to watch. The 04 Pistons. Truth be told, the Heat probably should have beat the well, no, the Heat would have beat the Pistons if D Wade was healthy. In only his second season. But hey, D Wade's time has come and gone. It's Dame time now. Damn, Paul George had 36. Westbrook had a, a triple-double. 29, 11, and 14. But Dame Lillard with a 50-piece. Crazy. The Blazers would play the winner of the Spurs Nuggets series, right? Yep, they'll face the winner of San Antonio, Denver. Man, Blazers might just be able to make it to the conference final. No disrespect to San Antonio or Denver, but they don't have a superstar like Dame Lillard on their roster. Damn, Billy Donovan looks 
old, bro. I bet he wishes uh, he was still at Florida. <laughs> oh, man. All right. This is box four. We'll see what's up in this thing. Yeah, Ryan McKenna, 150 Blue Jays. I'm sorry, Orioles. That's what I'm hoping for as well, Julian. I will say this, though. There's more color in Hobby as opposed to Jumbo. But Jumbo does have more autographs. So, But let's see if we can get some color up in this thing. Some big hits in this case. Come on, baby. I know you're lurking in there. Andrew Beck told twins autograph. It's like the third twin. Come on, Franco. Come out to play. A Luciano auto would be nice, too. Cedric Mullins, Orioles autograph. I'm trying, Brandon, baby. I'm trying. Julio Pablo Martinez, 499 Rangers. That'd be a nice hit with an auto. Trey Mancini, 499 Orioles. Come on, Bowman. I need you to heat up. My peeps need that fire. Come on. Ryan Weathers, 250 Padres.
Edward Cabrera to two ninety nine. Marlins uh, speckle auto. Could have been Victor Victor, but it's Edward Cabrera. All right, we're halfway through. We've got another four left. And I have no idea where I'm going to put some of this paper. I'm already running out of space in this contraption I MacGyvered here. Bowman, please heat up. Like now. And, you know, not trying to pick sides here, but definitely need a big hit for my boy Harry, who went and uh, got the biggest teams in this thing to help us fail. Come on, Bowman, come on. I like those Denver jerseys. Come on. Let's get you one, Greg. Let's get you one. All right, come on. Come on. Big hits, baby. Big hits. Ryan Weathers, 499 Padres. Tierso Ornelas to four nine nine Padres autograph. Nice hit right there for the Giants, Marco Luciano. Very nice.
Vince Fernandez, Rockies autograph. What? An extra auto in this thing. Bo Naylor to 199, the All American Baseball Auto. I'll be honest, I have no idea where he goes. Uh, the name sounds familiar, though. I want to say Indians. I'm gonna have to look that up on the checklist. Alex Kirloff, 250 Twins. <sighs> Excuse me. An atomic to 150 uh, for the Reds Hunter Green. Got a uh, Rylan Bannon, 125 Orioles. Righty. Three left. Three boxes left. card goes really yes yeah, what I thought Indians Let me write on that just in case. Help my shoulders out.
Damn, it's 1.30 in the morning. Whew. Yeah, Joe Paul, uh, you're kind of late to the party on that one. But thank you. <laughs> what? If you were smashed, you wouldn't be able to spell smashed. He might be in <laughs> this is true, Steve. <laughs> might be experienced in the in the smashed game. <laughs> yeah, I think that Luciano might be the biggest hit so far, right? Well there was that Matthias to ninety nine too, that was pretty nice. The Bowman Sterling auto. Kaboom, two ninety nine nationals. Nice hit right there. Eloy Jimenez. He's on the box. eBay 101, Gold Shimmer. Numbered 50 of 50. White Sox. Very nice hit right there. Decent. Brandon Marsh, four ninety nine Angels. Dang, it's 1.35 in the morning. Tom flies when you're having fun, baby. D.L. Hall, 499 Orioles. To 150, Liberatory Raise. A 
Another McKenna. This one's an Atomic Auto to 100 for the Orioles. Mackenzie Gore, 250 Padres. For the Royals, Gabriel Cancel, the autograph. Two boxes left. And I officially have nowhere to put this paper. Awesome. Cool. What the hell am I going to do now? Uh, I guess I'll put it here. In the corner for now. Because I have no space. Eloy's a pretty big one. Unfortunately, it's not his first Bowman autograph. I think Eloy's first Bowman came out like a year or two ago. Uh, Steve, I can't pull it back, but I could move it to the left, but I can't go more back than that.
the seventh box here. Franco, we could use you. I know my boy Harry could. Come on. Need a big hit here for somebody. Let's make it happen, Bowman. Well, Matt, you know, uh, what's it called? Uh, Rip City After Dark? Every now and then. Justin Dunn, 250 Mariners. Justice Sheffield, Yankees autograph. How you doing, Matt? What you doing up this late? That would be Mets, Julian, I think. Kalinic is Mets, I think. Oh, you were watching hockey, gotcha. Well, I don't know how good that game was, but I was watching the Blazers Thunder game, and that was a crazy ending. Sandro Fabian to 150 Giants. For the Blue Jays to 150, Danny Jansen. The autograph. Well, Joe Pa, that's you know that's 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 nice. You a big hobby, hockey fan, man? I'll admit, man, if it's not if it's not the Mighty Ducks playing, I have no idea what's going on there. In hockey. David Fletcher, Angels to 150. Alex Faedo, Tigers 499. Oh, Brandon was watching the game too. There you go. A little combo started going there.
Man, another Vince Fernandez for the Rockies right here. Autograph Mojo. I uh, need top loaders. Julian, I'm hoping the last box has uh, has some stupid, ridiculous fire. But you ain't never lied, player. You win some and you lose some. But it has come down to the last box here. And I'm hoping that it's a monster. Put the paper over here. Real quick, so we'll sort through this. Box Mojo. Nice, Julian. Making some money on that Josh Allen. I hope anyway. Alright, this is the last box here. All it takes is one hit to turn things around, baby. So I wish everybody good luck. Especially those without a hit. box mojo good luck everybody especially those without a big hit let's change it around here baby last box mojo come on wonder franco come on victor mesa joey bart Well, there's been two 101s in this. Two black printing plate 101s. This one is Keston Hira for the Brewers.
Mateo Gill to 250 Cardinals. The first autograph to come out here. Wow. Back to back Mateo Gills for the Cardinals. This one's to 150. And it all comes down to this last auto here. There you go, Steve. At least someone's happy. Let's see if we can make somebody else happy. And the last hit. Is Casey Golden for the Rockies. Later, Julian. Appreciate you, my dude. Have a good one, man. Dude, Harry. This was rough, brother. But uh, I'm going to do something for you, Harry. So check your email. Uh, if not tonight, tomorrow morning. But I'm, I'm going to send you a... Uh, a little care package, if you will. But check your email. I will be sending you something, my dude. Because I feel for you. This, uh... This was rough for you, Harry. Let's see, maybe there's a super fracture in here or something. Later, Joe Pa. Chan Spanberger, 499 Blue Jays. All in all, this case was pretty rough. Stack here. We got Matt Mercer, two ninety nine D backs. And that's going to do it for the break. Uh, correct, Matt. That is correct. The uh, the NFL draft, you mean, right? Yes. All the big names, baby. All right, so let's put this in some kind of order here. That's 299. So 250 right there. All right, so recap time, folks. We did have two 101s, two printing plate 101s, that is. One is Keston here at Brewers. The other one, 
Nick Nader, Marlins. All right. Now for the autos. We got Casey Golden Rockies. Ryan Costello Twins. Ryan McKenna Orioles. Reggie Lawson Padres. Andrew Begto Twins. Cedric Mullins Orioles. Marco Luciano Giants. Vince Fernandez Rockies. Gabriel Cancel Royals. Justice Sheffield Yankees. Vince Fernandez Rockies. Ryan McKenna Orioles 499. Ryan Costello Twins 499. Vince Fernandez Rockies 499. Tirso Ornelas Padres 499. Tommy Romero Rays 299. Edward Cabrera Marlins 299. Mateo Gill Cardinals 250. Uh, Bo Naylor 199 Indians. Mateo Gill 150 Cardinals. Danny Jansen 150 Blue Jays. Ryan McKenna 100 Orioles. Saoli Matias, 99 Royals. Nolan Gorman, 10 of 50 Cardinals. And a Elo Jimenez, 50 of 50 for the White Sox. And that, my friends, is going to do it for the break. Thank you very much. We'll get it out to you.